Hey guys, it's Vishnu, and today I'm going to be showing you how you can build this system to be able to unlock and lock your door for under 20 bucks. Passcode authorized, completing the bio lock, and boom, the door is now open. Let's get started with the project video. The parts you're going to need to the project are two Arduinos, in my case a Mega and an Uno, a couple of wires, a small LCD display, a button pin pad, a fingerprint sensor, and a small server motor. Let's get started with the building around this project. First, let's start by setting the pin pad. I used a pair of male to female jumper wires and I soldered them onto the pin pad using normal solder. Next, I pulled out my Arduino Mega and wired the buttons from the pin pad using the 8 wires that came with the pin pad up to the Arduino Mega. Next, I soldered on 12 wires to the LCD display board. The 4 in the middle aren't used for anything, so you can leave them blank. There are 6 on each side that you need to connect up to have a total of 12 out of 16 wires that you need to hook up. I hooked them up using the pattern I found online. Again, all of this patterns and schematics will be in the link in the description below on the Hackster page, so you can go there to get any of the schematics you need. Then I proceeded to wire up the display and the pin pad to the Arduino. I also connected an Arduino Uno in RX and TX mode for serial communications. I then proceeded to wire up my fingerprint sensor and connect the Arduino programming cable onto the Arduino Mega to start flashing the Arduino. Next, hop on over your computer and we can get started programming the Arduinos. Next, open up the Arduino ID and add the zip libraries required for this project. After that, click the upload button and upload the respective sketches to respective Arduinos. And rolling fingerprints is a lengthy process, and I'm not going to explain all here. However, there are tons of great tutorials online, and I will leave a few of them on the project page. I then found a piece of foam backing that I wanted to attach all the electronics on to clean it up a bit and make it look good. After some hot glue and some wiring, I ended up with a solution that looked kind of like this, which looked pretty cool. Now I just need to do a little more wire management and connect all the wires. After I connected it, I tried testing it out. I entered my password, 1092, click the hashtag button for enter and got to the bio lock screen. I put my fingerprint on the bio lock and boom, I was authorized as a user. Now I wanted to be able to unlock my door. So I, I 3D printed some parts for my servo. Again, these will be listed on the hackster.io page. After 3D printing them and hashing my servo, I hot glued these attachments onto my servo. And after that, I hot glued it onto my door. I waited a solid five minutes for it to set. And then I added some servo extensions from the servo to lead out the door. I then taped my wires up and led them through the door to be able to reach my access panel on the other side of the door. I then wired managed my wires using some electrical tape and some hot glue. If you enjoyed this video, then please be sure to hit the like button and subscribe button and turn on the notifications to be able to watch my videos in the future. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Vishnu and I'm signing out.